I did. I am. I did. No. It looks like a pretzel to me, but that's all right. It looks like a pretzel. It does. It looks like a shape of a pretzel. Oh, yeah, that's it. The young lady will show you how to do it. Now, take it from here, and you put it in here, put them in here, and they sprinkle them, and then we put them in the other next tray, and then they sell it. No, I'm eating that one. Oh, they can't yeah. sell that one. That's mine. I made that. <laughs> oh, yummy. Yummy, yummy. Yummy, yummy. Yummy. This is mine. I made it. Oh, you made it all by yourself? Yeah, I did. I goat it and I... All right, now we have to get some more. If they bring us the whole mess of them here, they can look at the They can try this way. When they're, they're cooked, they bring them over here, and we put them, we lay them down, and the girls take them out. Yeah, and some, of, some of them are larger Shouldn't than others. Sugar. And What's then the sugar? Just regular? It's just uh, Convection. confectionery sugar. That's all it is. And then they put them over there. They take this. We have an assembly line. They bring them from the stove. We put them in the next one. Have you been they standing here all night? I've been standing and sitting, and, you know, we sort of take turns. How many do you guys make uh, a night? Do you have any? Uh, well, last night oh we... Oh, my gosh. Look at that. That's how it goes. See, that's how it goes. <laughs> Go ahead. Do a good job. You're on television. Yeah. <laughs> then they sprinkle them. And then then we sell them. Then whoever who was ever at the counter to sell them. The lines yeah, are the line. around the entire... Yeah. Well, that's what happens, you know. But you every, sell every, every, Well, last night we sold 600 pounds of dough. How many would that make? John figures maybe 75 for a pa uh, package, and sometimes it's 35, and sometimes it's uh, it's all according to how many pounds they put. Westchester Bakery. Yeah. It's all according to how many pounds are in the bags. The bags are over there. So it's it's a way of making some money, right? Oh yes. Oh yes. It's a good thing to do because oh, it's, it's a very good thing yeah. to do because it, of course it's a lot of work right. and it's hot as you can see. Hot. But you know, but we do very well. Tonight isn't as bad as it could have been. No. And then, tomorrow night should be busier, and 4th of July, we're very... Parade night, we were kind of scotched because it switched the, the nights, which didn't help us, but we did all right. You know, I think we did all right as far as... I don't know how much money they, they got. So when you... Uh, then it's all according to... Then they take... See, they, they figure the tickets. They're, they're, it's whatever number he How much does it cost? I didn't $2 a, a piece. They said we should have raised it, but we didn't this year. We've had a $2. Raise it. Well, because everything costs so much money. You know, that's the thing. And but they're so delicious. They are. They really they are. They are so Everybody delicious. comes back and more. Everybody comes back for one, and then they come back for two, and we sell ten. Parade night, we'll sell fifteen and twenty. The lines you know, are like, the yeah, lines are really yeah, incredible. Down and yeah, so. and you can't cook them fast enough. That's the bad so part. So one of the biggest things to do when you come down to the carnival, whether it's uh, next year or the year after that, is to come to the pizza. How do you, pizza frita? Pizza, pizza frita. Pizza frita. Pizza frita. Not pizza frita. Pizza no, frita. Pizza frita. The pizza frita booth. And you get the most delicious. It's just wonderful, you know? It, it's just fried dough, that's all. No, but it's delicious. I think, yeah. <laughs> but it is delicious. And everybody everybody thinks it's delicious. And they come back every year for it. And even the firemen, Me when too. they parade, they, come, they especially come over here for it. I mean, that's the night. And 4th of July, they'll be coming over and everybody works so hard and it's like you know well, that's the good part you know and then they also sell the drinks afterwards yeah. is that it well that's on that side that's not the ladies oh it's that's a different but well, is that's it the men the but men. it's the same thing oh, when you come same. in right? yeah yeah but they're selling the beer and the, we have coffee you want coffee no they have beer and I'd soda rather drink uh, yucky food oh, okay. <laughs> well not they have beer and soda and uh, they're selling it here Excellent. and that's what and thank you so You're much very welcome. I'm going to leave now with Did my... That's not my husband, well, that's Pat. My husband's over there. Well, you said your husband. There's my husband right there talking okay. to Tony. Okay. You want one, honey? Does he want one? Sure. Sure he does. As soon as it comes out. We won't give you one, give him one you made. 
No, I'm going to give him the one I made. I'm going to eat the one I made. I'm no fool. <laughs> I'm not eating the one I made. <laughs> Does the cameraman want one? You want one camera person, Pat? Who's related to everybody in the village of Mamaronek? The Mikalizzi, the Mikalizzi family? Oh, yeah. This is, this is for her husband. Okay. This is for her. No, that's for me. I'm going to eat the one the real people made. My husband's getting the one I made. All right. This is for you. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Enjoy. Thank you so much. Come again. I will. Come again. Don't forget, when you come down, it's very hot. And uh, to support the firemen. And it's delicious, and they make money from it, and that's what the carnival is all about. So don't forget. That's Thank right. you, guys. Thank you. You know, I'm beginning to think that the only reason I let Pat Nicolizzi convince me to do this every year is so that I could go and show you guys how to make a pizza Frida and then wind up eating it. It is so delicious, but it's just one of the many million things to come down here to do and support the community the fire department. And if you don't want to eat pizza Fridas and if you don't want to go and ride to meet friends, that you haven't seen in a million years. You meet Pat Michalusi's relatives who you don't even know for a million years. It's wonderful, it's supportive, it's a beautiful night. Remember that it always happens the last week in July, or June, the first week of July. Fireworks and everything. Just keep supporting the fire department and uh, see you next year. Pat and I say, Pat, my little precious baby, and I say, you want a bite? Yeah. Holy oh, God, it's hot. <laughs> Bye. What the carnival means to me is community, friends, and family. It's some place that we all get together. We meet up with each other. It's a good time to meet. Most times you all you get people together when there's something wrong that happens or somebody loses someone. But this is a great time, and it's a good time for people to get together. It's a happy time, and I hope I can do this for the next 10 or 20 years. I've been instructed by my better half to say what the carnival means to me, and I think what it means is it's, it's a great community, Mamaronek. Uh, the carnival shows that everybody, you know, still has that spirit of what Mamaronek is all about. We've been living here for 30 years. We love it as much now as we did when we first got here, and uh, that's what Harbor Island and the carnival is all about. We came here many years ago when the kids were very young, and it still seems as lively and, uh, and as exciting as it was then. Well, the carnival means to me is, not just for me, it's for the community. You know, uh, bringing people together, having fun, having a lot of laughs. It's a sense of community. It's a great community, Mamaronek. Community. That's the main thing, community. Everybody getting together. It's a special place for family to get together. Oh, uh, I like coming to the carnival, bring my son down there. He has a good time. It's a nice place to hang out. Nothing beats the festive atmosphere as the uh, village of Mamaronek fire carnival. It's a great place to come and help support a terrific worthy cause. You have no better fire department in all of Westchester, if not New York, than the volunteer fire department right here. So um, thanks a lot. I better shut up. I'll, I'll get edited out. Have a good night and come on down. Be a great 4th of July. Well, they call me the fireman. That's my name. Making my rounds all over town, putting out all flames.